you don't get a candle because you're all special to me or you wouldn't be here. The first candle goes to my squad one. I give you all this candle because you're a group of friends that never let me down. Akila, you always kept it real with me since day one. Jury, you always had my back and understood where I was coming from. And Talia, there's never a dull moment with you. You girls are my ride or die squad. Can you three come up and get a candle? Squad two, I give you all this candle because you're a group of girls I can always count on for anything and everything. Jayla, you and I have built a wonderful friendship that I will cherish forever. Kimberly, I can always count on you to fill my heart with laughter. Kayla A, you, you will always be that friend that will give me just as much attitude as I give you, and then we end up doing something dumb and funny worth remembering. And Kayla G, I can always count on you to get down and party. You girls are my two live crew, and I give you all this candle to remember the fun times we've had and to cherish more. Can you four girls come up and get a candle? I give you this candle because you're no longer my friend, you're my sister. I've only known you for a year, but we share so many laughs and fun moments, it seems like we've known each other for longer. I can trust you and depend that you won't let me down. You don't judge me, and you're always that shoulder I can lean on. You're the bloom to my flower and the hope to my future that we'll always be friends. June 28th is our turn up day. I love you, girl. Now please come up and get a candle. I give you this candle because you're my slider, partner in crime, best friend, but more like family. You are like a sister to me, and I thank God he introduced us. We've been best friends for about five years, and I can honestly say it's time well spent. You get on my nerves so much, but I know it's all out of love. You are the meatballs to my spaghetti and the dressing to my salad. You are always there when I need to talk and always have open ears and arms, and I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. I love you with all my heart, and nobody can ever change that. Not in a million years. Savannah, please come up and get a candle. because you're not just a cousin and a friend. You're my brothers. Together you two do the most ridiculous things, but I love you two with all my heart. I look up to you both like a sister should. Josh and Chris, can you please come up and get a candle? I give you this candle because you're my crazy little brother that I love. You wrestle me, push me, fight me, and you're a strong little boy. You just need to go easy on me. But I end up catching you and attacking you with kisses, which you probably think is gross. Oh, but I love you, and every time I get to see you, I cherish the time. Anyways, Jonathan, can you please come up and get a candle? <laughs> Don't burn down anything, Jonathan. <laughs> I give you this candle because I love you so much. Simon, you get on my nerves so much. I yell and argue with you for some of the dumbest things, but it's all out of love. I care so much about you, and you make me laugh. Wrong or right, I'll always be by your side. I'm so glad to have a brother like you. 
LOL, you're my chauffeur, big brother, and my other half. What would I do without you? I think you get the point. I love you. Simon, please come up and get a candle. I give you this candle because, because you're like a second mom to me. I remember all the times we went to Arizona and we went to the water parks and had a blast. All the times we went to the Grand Canyon and watched that movie over and over and over and we never got tired of it. Whenever my mom wasn't there, you watched over me and protected me like I'm one of yours. I thank you for all the fun times and look for more to come. Auntie Puggy, can you please come up and get a candle? because you're my uncle and I love you. You've been around my whole life and I'm glad you are. You have one big hug that I love. Whenever I see you, I run up and hug you and that lasts for a long time. You treat me as if I'm your daughter and just don't want me to grow up. Too bad it's happening. Anyway, Uncle David, please come up and get a candle. I give you this candle because you're my grandmother that I love so much. You always give such sweet words of encouragement. I remember going to the Bahamas and everybody was leaving me behind and you were always there to comfort me. You will always hold a deep and dear spot in my heart. You're the sweetest of them all. Mumsy, can you come up and get a candle? Oh, gee, Ma, we get into so many arguments, and I give you so much slack to the point you don't know what to do with me. Thanks for all the hard work when you would get up early in the morning to take me to school and always being there when I needed a ride. I could always count on you to have open arms, and at the end of the day, no matter how many times we fuss, I really do love you, and nothing will ever change that. Grandma, can you please come up and get a candle? I love you. 
There's never a time when you don't keep it 100 with me. You can be really chill at times, but you can also get on my nerves. Just as much as I get on yours. You're always thinking of your two kids before anything or anyone else. You are the roof that covers me when I need shelter. You are always able to provide, even if it's the last penny you have in your bank account. You provide shelter, food, clothes, shoes, money, warm hugs, but most of all, your love. You're an amazing woman and an excellent mother. I appreciate all you do for me. You always know when something's wrong with me and will drop everything you're doing to listen and comfort me. You're the best mother I can ask for. Nobody will ever take your place. Thank you for being my number one supporter. Many people can say their mom is the best, but they haven't met you until, and until they do, they should just keep their mouth shut. So who cares what they think? You are the best. Mom, please come up and get a kiss. Okay, now can you all take a seat while I do the last two candles? So blow it out.